back. How's it going, everybody? Top of the morning to you. Hope everybody is either having or have had a productive day. And thank you for your time. All right. Man, what do you think about them storms up north in the northeast? Wow, man. You got Vermont, Vermont looking like Venice. <clears throat> All right. Let me get into this topic here that I was looking around for some articles that I wanted to talk about. And this one that I'm about to talk about, I kind of find it very, very intriguing. But let me tell you what it what's what it's about. So this is South Fulton, Atlanta. Okay, uh, I guess it appears to be a township, and this guy, Khalid Kamo, Kamo, the mayor of Atlanta, wanted to try to make its own, it, it, South Foot in his own city. Well, anyway, the VOs about this guy is being, uh, has been arrested, and actually he made bond, from what I understand, it was $11,000 bond for burglary, burglary and trespassing. And he had some checkered allegations from what I understand like last year. But I got to tell you, I, ha I have to commend him for because one of his uh, things on his agenda was he wanted to break Saul Fult uh, Saul Fulton off to be its own city. And I got to tell you, you know, I, I do admire that. You know, so we'll get back to that here in a second. But uh, this guy had done some things, according to the news I've seen about four or five articles from the news out there in Atlanta. Okay. Shout out today. I got a lot of family there. I used to live in Georgia back in the day, Savannah. Actually, my grandparents and great grandparents were from Albany, Georgia. A little town out in Albany called Blake. But you know, farming wasn't profitable anymore, and so they moved up to the Northeast, <clears throat> up to Philly and Jersey and them places. But there's still family there. But anyway, <clears throat> this guy had misused his city, I guess, city funds through a credit card. And I guess he held a Easter egg hunt without a permit, okay? Uh, I think one of the things that probably the city did not find amusing, amusing that this is the city in Atlanta, which comprises of about, what, nine or 10 different cities, okay? three different counties was Kamal was trying to investigate the city council. Okay. Now I don't know if it's Atlanta city council or South Fulton city council. Okay. Uh, through, uh, through like a violation of the open records act. Okay. According to the art, uh, the article, the, or the podcast I read that he was trying to investigate the Atlanta city council. Okay for whatever reason. And I think that they didn't find that, again, very, very amusing at all, okay? But here's what I wanna say. And again, I do admire the guy, but I think that if you're gonna try to do something that bold, okay, let's just say those guys are more than likely in the craft. They're probably the fraternities and sororities and that type of stuff, more than likely, okay? That's why I say in the craft, and they're trying to do something that bold. It's one of the things that you better be a, a, a model citizen. Not saying that you can't make mistakes, but your mistakes better be so egregious, I mean, I'm sorry, not egregious, but so uh, minute or uh, so minor to, to where they could be overlooked. All right. South Fulton, I read about this a couple of uh, years ago, was a township where <clears throat> they have an all black may, uh, mayor at the time. 
uh, city council, the the courts, all black, and the fire department. Okay, so most of the city government was pretty much uh, a so-called black, you know, uh, people that was running that that uh, that township. So uh, the people at that in that lived in South Fulton had recommended or they tried to uh, advocate that he needs to step down. Now, I think he's probably going to step down. He, he got out. He apologized, okay, for what he did or whatever, okay? But, see, what they do is, and again, I think that they went in on him. The lady's name, okay, I'll tell you who's the lady, uh, the active mayor is in a second, but I believe that the rest of the mayors in that the city of Atlanta, greater uh, greater area, okay, that they waited for him to do something egregious, and then they added everything up. You see what I'm saying? So all the little stuff, and they tacked it up, and they, you know what I'm saying? They threw it at, at, threw the book at him. Her name is Natasha Williams Brown, is the acting mayor. According to news reports, okay, she even said that she prepared herself to, you know, to be in the position that she is an acting mayor of South uh, South Foot. So she wants to keep everything the same, a lot of stuff the same, all right? But I think they wanted him out because when those officials get elected, let's just face it, okay? They want you pretty much to be a good boy, okay? And do what them folks tell you to do and I think that if you go against the grain, all right, then that's kind of that's kind of going to rough up feathers a little bit, all right. As far as in like in making waves and all that, okay, that good stuff. So that's what happened there, okay. So it's one of the things that I think that again, if you're going to try to go up against the city or whatever, or uh, I don't know to make a uh, to do something that ultimate uh, that big. Then I think that you knew that already. Then your your career, even your life, may be at jeopardy. So let me know what you think about uh, this video here. All right, I'm just saying though, it, this video is basically saying that you need better hope that you have your own house in order. Okay, before you want to try to go up in somebody else's house, you were able to see that through this video, but. All right, let me know what you think.